A project in Mayville, North Dakota that started as a way to honor a 9-11 victim from our state has now reached across an ocean and with big results. Today, elementary students there celebrated a remarkable year of giving and remembering. All because donated backpacks made it to the poorest of the poor, Paul. The story from WDAY 6 reporter Kevin Wallavent. When I call your name, Clara, come and get your specific letter. And Mrs. Annabelle. Fugelberg's second grade class today. Noah. It was a little like Christmas. And then I'm going to give you a letter written so everyone can read what they wrote back to us. Letters have arrived from new friends in Nepal. The names are going to look different, boys and girls, aren't they? The letters come from children who recently received 200 backpacks collected and sent by the entire elementary school here in Mayville. Oh yeah, and we talked about this. Where do they live? The reason for the project, the person behind it, and a woman remembered are made for a TV movie script. She'd be pretty happy. Stanley, North Dakota native Ann Nelson died during the World Trade Center attacks on 9-11. She was someone when she traveled to Peru, she didn't stay in fancy hotels and, and go to fancy nightclubs. She went to the orphanages and worked. Her friend, Mayville Special Ed Director Mary Stamen, heard that Ann's family had discovered a special life list or bucket list on Ann's computer. The word Nepal stood out. Anne could no longer get there, but Mary and Mayville children sure could send a piece of North Dakota to Nepal. So 200 backpacks were bought, and the kids sent letters they wrote to the children in the earthquake region of Nepal. They went to the very neediest kids in, in Nepal. But the backpacks got held up at customs. Corrupt officials wanted more than $1,000 to release the backpacks to the children. But Senator Heidi Heitkamp's office intervened, sent a letter to the embassy, and the backpacks and letters of love from Mayville soon got to the kids there. So with us today, I'm here to talk to you is Senator Heidi Heitkamp. Please Heitkamp please. came to congratulate the children for an incredible service learning project that taught everyone some valuable life lessons. Start just as a small seed in Mary's mind of what can happen when you take an idea and you say, I hope I can get this done. I didn't know who you are. Please send me your photo. Back in Mrs. Fugelberg's classroom, the kids are finding out more about their pen pals in Nepal. From Nepal, I would like to say thank you for your gift. My now, Mayville kids yeah. will write back. I, ju I just like meeting new people. From Mayville, Kevin Walvin, WDOI 6 News. Despite a significant time zone difference, the students in Mayville hope to Skype the students in Nepal. Now back to our weather.